Please welcome on stage Christian Müller. It's uh, an honor for me to stand here at the ending of the first day of the NEOSCON 2017 and present you the NEOS Awards 2017. Yeah. And please also get a warm applause for my two co-hosts. We three were the jury for this award. Welcome them as well. And after just one year with awards, we didn't know what to expect from this year. So we opened up the submissions and waited for submissions. And after a while, they trickled in. Uh, but at the end of the deadline, we were pretty happy to actually have 24 submissions. And I have to say, 24 awesome submissions. It was really a hard choice, and to give you an impression how hard that choice wa was, uh, let's watch together what we got. So it was really hard for us. And what you saw was basically just pictures of things. But most of the submissions obviously were websites because we are talking about a CMS. But there's also a framework involved. So it was not only websites, but we also got submissions for applications and for all kinds of stuff that you cannot see in just a short slideshow. Um, so in short, we had a hard time to get this thing done and to select a winner out of all these awesome submissions. So um, what we did is uh, we basically voted on three things here. Um, we, ch we checked for the authenticity and the brand of the website. So basically, was it very cool? Was it innovative? Uh, from the looks, was it uh, a well-known brand, all these kind of things. Um, then we looked at the technical aspects, obviously. I mean, we only had the descriptions, so we had to base that on the descriptions, but that was the second category we looked at. Um, how well was the front end done? What did we know about the back end and all that? And third, but not last, obviously, the design and usability of the website or application that we, uh, that we looked at. So uh, we all three did that and came up with some numbers, and it was pretty close. It was really pretty close, I can say. Um, I think there, were, there was definitely no bad votes. There was just good and better votes. So whoever doesn't get an award in the end, don't be unhappy, it is really, all of these submissions I saw were really awesome things, so uh, that you are up here and submitted something says a lot about it already. Okay, I think we can slowly get started and have a look at the actual winners of this award, uh, which is, by the way, provided by Midwald. Right, so we will start with the Excellence Awards. So in total, we have six prizes. We have three excellent aw Excellence Awards that we choose after the first three spots. Um, and those we recognized by some specific thing that we really liked about it, uh, regardless of the voting in other of the categories. And um, additionally, on top, we have the bronze, silver, and gold 
um, awards, which are the real best votes we had. So, but let's start with the Excellence Awards, obviously. Um, those that stood out, but didn't really make it up to the top three. First of it is a website about hotels. And this website was already an award last year, but there were some significant changes in it, and um, there was really cool stuff happening uh, on the back-end side and the user experience for the editors in this website. Um, so we had a look at it again, and as it was mostly about a change in this and not about a whole new project, it didn't make it to the top three, but it's still pretty awesome what happened in the Hospitality Alliance uh, backend and user experience. Uh, this is done by Sidegeist, so one of Sidegeist, please. Congratulations. Wonderful. That's our first Excellence Award. That was pretty obvious. It is, it's really a nice project if you have a look at it. And uh, if you're wondering, our winners get two awards because we thought, why not give one of the two to the actual client? So they also see what they accomplished with this project. The second excellence award is something you cannot see online, unfortunately. Um, it's all about emails in this case. And the product description of this, even though we couldn't see it, was so convincing and so detailed that we wanted to give it an excellence award for the technical implementation of this. And so the Swisscom mailer made by Web Essentials, which is a very complex um, emailing system, you could say a newsletter system, but it's pretty awesome based on Flow and Neos. And that's our second excellence award. Welcome on stage, <laughs> Web Essentials. Right, two gone, one left. Who will be our third excellence award? Hmm, they have it already. The third one. The third one was really hard, and we switched around a few times because it was really close at this point. And we had two excellence awards for technical implementations, obviously. So. The third one is not about a technical implementation, but very much about the experience for the visitor of this website. Um, the whole brand seems to work very well in this website. Uh, there's a lot of content, and it just felt good for us to serve this website. So it is the Tourismus region Car Wendel made by Kamau. Congratulations. What do you think? Awesome projects, right? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so, let's start slowly with the actual award. No, no, let's do the photos later. I mean, you don't need to watch us taking pictures. That doesn't make much sense. Um, <laughs> I think it's better if we do that after you left and have some fresh air here, right? So.
Wonderful. You ready for the Bronze Award? NEO's Bronze Award this year is a website with a huge amount of products and a pretty nice design and a lot of other features. And the presentation was also pretty convincing for us. And um, there was a lot of detail provi provided in, um, for the background of this project. And we are very proud to announce the bronze award this year goes to Meister.com, made by Core4. Welcome on stage, Core4. Congratulations. Do you want to say something about it? You don't have to, but you can. <laughs> I'm, off I'm offering the choice. I'm offering a choice. Okay, um, just, just pointing. Um, you know, basically, um, the more technical part of this project will partly be covered in my talk tomorrow in the evening. Um, it has to do with, uh, for example, Elasticsearch indexing and um, how to do that in three minutes instead of uh, like half a day. And um, yeah, uh, just uh, to tease you a little for the uh, graph talk tomorrow. So. Oh well, yeah, no. uh, yeah, that's that's technically another project, but um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's us, uh, the second. Um, a project for this customer for us, and so it was rather easy to link from one platform to the other one, which is then a complete integration of, of Magento into Neos, with uh, Neos doing all the rendering stuff. But um, yeah, that's a different topic. <laughs> would, you, would you give us just one or two sentences to actually describe what, what happens on this website? Because I thought you can do that much better than I would, I would so. So, um, yeah, um, technically this is all about flooring. So if you want to, uh, if you want to have a really good flooring in your house, um, and uh, you are um, willing to pay a little more money for that, <laughs> so <laughs> so th this is uh, rather premium flooring on this website. It's uh, by Meister, which is um, a company in uh, the center of Germany somewhere, and um, their idea was to present the whole um, product catalog. Uh, on a website, we're talking about, um, and the, one thing is, it's only a few thousand products, but those products exist in five di different language variants and nine different market variants. So we're um, up to a total of uh, some 50, 60,000 nodes in the system. Um, it works quite, quite nicely with the Elasticsearch integration. Uh, you can uh, browse there in um, all viewports that you like. Um, there is a third-party tool integrated uh, to configure a predefined room with different floorings um, to find something that you like. And then you can just switch over to the, um, to the shop platform and buy if you want. So, yeah. Great. Thank you. Great. So if you want to hear more about this, why it's award-winning, probably listen in tomorrow. All right, that was the Bronze Award. Let's go over to Silver. And our Silver Award is actually an application. Uh, it has a bit of NEOS integration by now as well, but it's mainly an application, and we choose it because of uh, what it does and how it's presented and the technical implementation behind it because it's actually pretty cool what's happening there. And um, I think, again, the creator can tell better than me what it is. So let's welcome on stage uh, the creators of Past Creator, David Sporer. Congratulations. So, at least you have to tell us what it's about. 
Um, yeah, thank you first. Um, it's an online application that allows you to create digital passes for smartphones. So basically event tickets, uh, store cards, vouchers. And uh, you can use the application to create them, distribute them to your uh, end customers, and update the passes. So we have lots of integrations to the APNS service of Apple, for example, to update the passes and the Android uh, implementation of that as well. Um, and it's yeah based completely on, on Flow. It's a, a software as a service uh, application, and I'm doing a talk tomorrow um, that basically tells you something about the project history, how we started out, and um, our hosting setup that we're currently working on based on Kubernetes and Docker. Cool. Would you mind giving the one number that I found pretty nice? How many badges did you deliver? Um, last year, it was uh, 650,000 passes worldwide. Cool. Thank you. That was our silver award. And again, you have the chance to hear more about it tomorrow. But now, the final, the best award. I think. No, not really, not really, but I don't want to spoil the surprises. The Gold Award. Give a clap. Come on. The Gold Award. And I think, I think I don't have to say much about the project itself. Uh, we heard a bit about it in the showcases earlier already. Uh, it's obviously pretty convincing to be a top candidate for the Gold Award, and uh, it was a pretty obvious choice from our votings as well. Um, it's a super complex solution. It's uh, pretty cool. A lot of people worked on it, and I would welcome network team on stage for this. <laughs> so. Yeah, so um, I would like to invite someone from NetLogix and Sandstorm 2 maybe because it's yes. really a joint venture so we couldn't have done it alone and it's it's really a great success story that we from the NEOS team um, uh, could do such a great project on NEOS that we built for quite some years and yeah thanks to the customer for the challenge and the chance <laughs> to do that yeah and I think we are happy to have won that prize and uh, <laughs> <laughs> that was the only goal one, win the prize and now oh. you're done well I think that's a pretty cool award for 2017 um, I guess if you have more questions about this solution you can ask around there are lots of people that worked on it actually uh, because it's pretty big project and we are all happy to have this here and present you the award, finally. So, give a clap to basically all our award winners. <laughs> yeah, afterwards. Yeah. Yeah. Basically, that concludes our awards for this year. And I think we had pretty nice uh, awards and pretty nice projects up here. But again, all submissions were pretty cool projects, and there is no loser in this, really. So this concludes the awards. But it's a running gag with us. I also have one more thing for the award. And some of you may know that I'm very involved with the community of NEOS, and I thought it fitting at this point 
to extend something else. So a more community-based thing. There is community spirit in this community. And some of you that were on a lot of events in the past may remember one of the inspiring conferences a few years back. Um, there was Christian Yul Jensen holding a talk on stage. And at some point, he invited me to stage and inofficially presented me with a Friendly Ghost Community Award. And I never took the chance to pass this on to someone else. And I think by now it's time and it's the right place to say uh, thank you to another community member, to another team member. And in that regard, please give a clap and I hope you didn't leave and are in the room. Uh, Dimitri, would you join me on stage? <laughs> I think you, you well earned it. You well earned this. And obviously, this is the awards. That's all shiny stuff. I just have a small present for our friendly ghost. And this is a unique piece that uh, Bastian sponsored. It's, it's the only, only cup in this way that, hap that, that exists. And it's yours now. Um, carry on the friendly ghost spirit and maybe appoint a new friendly ghost next year. So thank you so much. I think when you receive such thing, it means you have to try to get off slack. And <laughs> 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 to catch up with exactly. That's why, why this is happening. So <laughs> because I'm so happy that I don't, I don't have to do all the things in slack anymore. So, I think we are all warm in here and thirsty and we want to get out and grab a beer or some dinner before we go over to the social event. Uh, that's why I didn't bother to make it too long. I think everyone is uh, happy with this outcome. So, um, let's close this. Uh, thank you all for a wonderful first day of the NEOS conference. And we see each other in a few hours at our cool party. Thank you. So thank you very much. Um, thank you, Christian. Just one last information uh, regarding the party. <laughs> yeah. Um, don't throw your small paper away. Use it. It's beer over there. It's cold and it's included. It's for free. Um, and um, this will be the place. And these are the two sponsors of the social award, Gesagt Getan and uh, OneDrop, but they will have the chance to promote themselves, especially in this social event, because at that social event there are only two sponsors, these two. Um, it's in the Hörsaal. This is the name of the place. And um, it's um, including drinks. There is a limit, but maybe you can, you can crack it. We will see. Um, there is no dinner. There's nothing fancy like in the type of street community. There's a kind of president dinner or stuff like this. It's just finger food. If you're really hungry right now, then take some small food maybe to prepare yourself. There is some finger food and it's cool, but um, it's not to get... Um, uh, if you're very hungry, then you need to have something more. And um, the information is we are right now here in the Gastwerk. Um, my foot is not... Uh, no, it won't work. Um, by car, it's 15 minutes. You can took, uh, take the S-Bahn, which is very near here, Holstenstraße. 
Barenfeld, excuse me, Barenfeld. This is the closest S-Bahn to the Gastwerk. And um, even for the participants from abroad, it's very easy to remember the name of the S-Bahn station, of the train station, uh, where you have to go. The name is um, Ripperbahn. So just remember. So I mean, you won't forget it, I'm sure. And yeah, thank you very much for the first part of the first day because this uh, <coughs> belongs to the first day and very often the part, the party between the, the two days is one of the best one. Prepare yourself, fresh you up, and we will see you eight o'clock and we will have a party. Thank you very much. <laughs>